Hello and welcome to Things You Can't Talk About on TV, International Travellers Edition. We are coming to you from Caesarea, which is on the northern coast of Israel. Now, Ginny, today it's something that's hit me. It's when you start your holidays, you're okay, and then you fall in a heap and you get sick. Why does this happen? Oh my goodness, you were so green, oh. Shelley. This happens to so many people. I've got a couple of theories. Number one, you know just before you go on holidays, you are just like pelting to the finish line. Yeah. You are just doing 10 hours a day of work. You're trying to get the kids ready, the dog ready, the house ready, and then you hit the holiday and you just kind of fall in a heap. During that stress time, your adrenaline and cortisol have gone up and then they crash down. That can make anyone feel really, really tired and unwell. And then you hit the Petri dish that is the plane, <laughs> train or bus that's escorting you to your next holiday. I swear on the flight over here, I was sitting next to someone who just coughed and coughed and coughed. Is that why I'm sick? I was surrounded by like 10 people who I was convinced had tuberculosis. <laughs> it could be a problem, but on the whole it's not. You know, you and I have both had colds and you cough for four weeks afterwards. It's actually the people who are looking really green, maybe sitting really quietly with a fever, hatching some really nasty flu <laughs> that are ones you really need to worry about. So what can you do? Okay, what I would do for sure is wash your hands, especially before you eat. Really, really important. And then, you know, you need to make sure that you're entering your holiday feeling reasonably well rested and healthy. And what about the fact that you're exposed to unusual bugs overseas? Absolutely, you've got no immunity, particularly in a third world country. So, Shelley, we've got to do as we say <laughs> and not as we did <laughs> and relax That's far nice. more before you go into your holiday so that you can relax and unwind. Shh.